Welcome to the Country Castle. Today I wanted to show you a DIY of these cute spooky ghosts. You only need a handful of supplies and you have the most adorable Halloween decor you can bring out every year. You will need a foam base to set your ghosts on to dry, some styrofoam balls, cheesecloths, some Mod Podge or glue, some felt for the faces, black paint, or permanent marker. We are going to start with one part, Mod Podge and water. Just equal parts will do the trick. And then we are going to set up our foam base. This is important to be able to let your ghost dry upright. I just set the skewers in my base and then I'm going to set up the shape of my first ghost. You can be creative and make any shape you want. We're also gonna cover our shape with plastic wraps so that the cheesecloth doesn't dry to the foam ball and it makes it easier to remove. We are gonna grab our cheesecloth, just cut it to the size you want it. We're gonna drench it in the glue mixture. We're gonna wring it out and set it on top of our ghost. I do about three to four layers of cheesecloth on my ghost, but you can experiment with this and do as many or as little layers as you want, just depending on the look that you want for your ghost. Now we're gonna do some final shaping and then move on to adding the face. I used black felt. I just cut out my eyes and my mouth and added them on with some glue, but you could also use black paint or permanent marker. I like to add another layer of cheesecloth to my ghosts as well, just I love the spooky look of that layer over the eyes. Once you've added the finishing touches to your ghosts, you will let them dry overnight, then you're ready to display them. I think these are so fun and whimsical, and I hope that you try this out. Happy Halloween!